All right, hello. Today I have the pleasure of speaking with Ms. Mary Davis. Um, today, Ms. Davis, I'm just gonna ask you uh, a few questions about your journey here at Maple Park and what that experience has really meant to you. So just to start, what first drew you to Maple Park? Were you invited? Did you visit on your own? What, what first brought you here? I was invited by uh, to Maple Park by a uh, um, wonderful cousin of mine, Odessa Witherspoon, who's deceased now. And uh, the first Sunday that I visited, uh, she wasn't in attendance. And uh, I came back the next Sunday, and the rest was, uh, I just never looked back. And with me, I brought my daughter, Sandra and Sheila, and we felt at home and, and I, it became, we became members in 1987, I believe. Yeah, wow, that's, yeah, that's been a, a long time for sure. So what has kept you connected to the church over all these years? Well, uh, things that, have really kept us uh, coming back or, or connected, I should say. Um, it's the warmth and and uh, that I get from the church. Uh, it's very family oriented, and they are very supportive. And especially, um, I realized this uh, back in two thousand and nine. I, uh, Sheila and I, and especially Tyler, lost his, uh, my daughter Sandra in a car accident. And the church overwhelmingly backed us. You know, they really were there for us, and especially, you know, for Tyler. And, uh, and that's, that's, really pretty much the reason why we've uh, continued to stay um, in touch and, and and feel very, you know, at home at Maple Park. Yeah, and I definitely remember that time when Sandra passed and yeah, just even as like someone looking on on that, like you could definitely feel the love that like was being given to your family during that time, especially like to Tyler. Um, so yeah, yeah. And I think that's just like something common, like there's definitely so much love amongst our community. Yes, it is. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, and so during your time here at Maple Park, what ministries have you served on and how have they helped bring you closer to not only like the church congregation, but also just to God? Well, um, I, I know a lot of the members uh, recognize that, first of all, I'm uh, uh member of the usher board but some of some of the uh, past uh ministry i was a class le active class leader and um for a short time i served in the membership uh area yeah i definitely recognized you as uh one of the figureheads of of the usher board for sure you're definitely a smiling face we get to see every Sunday morning uh welcome oh uh, you're so that's so <laughs> lovely to hear that honestly yeah absolutely um and then what do you see as like some of Maple Park's greatest strengths uh, some of their strengths as as I said is the is the warmth that you know people uh so unselfishly gives, you know, to people, you know, uh, not just to the members, but visitors. Yeah, I, I think that's something we, we keep hearing, like with all these legend interviews, like there's a lot of warmth, like within our community. Um, so yeah, just hearing you like reiterate that is really great. Um, oh, that, and that's awesome. That says a lot, really. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Um, and then just to finish like with this last question, Maple Park is really constantly evolving and learning how to adapt to the changing world and also just the changing needs of our community. So what do you envision for our church's future? Well, I, I, I uh, rather envision um, 
the church continue growing, uh, reaching out to, you know, more young young people, you know, young adults and youth, you know, find some kind of way of reaching out to them. And, and, and one of our models, uh, I might not be totally exact uh, and in the slogan that we used to say, open heart, minds, and doors. And I, and I truly believe that we have to keep that, uh, in our, in our main site. It's uh, never, you know, uh, make people feel, uh, uncomfortable or, uh, um, just, uh, as, as we have in the past, just make, uh, continue to welcome, you know, the community. Yeah, always keeping that motto and mission like at the forefront of our work is really important for sure. Yes, yes. Um, yeah, so thank you so much for giving me the opportunity to speak with you today, Ms. Davis. You're absolutely an important member of our congregation and in this community. And we're just so grateful to call you a legend here at Maple Park. So thank you so much for giving me the chance to talk with you today. And thank you for the opportunity of, of you know, making a statement to that effect. Absolutely. All right. I mean. All right. <laughs>